the geography, tropical rainforests. In today, the learning objectives are characteristics of tropical rainforests, how tropical rainforests are interdependent and adaptations of plants and animals in rainforests. If you want, you can use the timestamps to skip around the video. The characteristics of a tropical rainforest. Animals. Rainforests contain more animal species than any other ecosystem. Many indigenous people have adapted to live in the rainforest and they make a living by hunting, farming and fishing. Plants and soil. Most of the trees are evergreen to help them take advantage of the continual growing season. Plants and soil. Many trees are very tall and the vegetation cover is dense. There's very little light that actually reaches the forest floor. There are lots of epiptites, which are plants that grow on other living plants and take the nutrients from the air. Soil. The soil is not very fertile as heavy rain washes away the nutrients, but there is surface nutrients due to decayed leaf fall. Climate. The climate is the same all year round, generally between 20 to 28 degrees Celsius. Why is this? The sun's energy is most intense near the equator, as is overhead all year round. Rainfall is very high, around 2,000 millimetres per year. It rains daily. How tropical rainforests are interdependent. Interdependent means when all the parts of an ecosystem are dependent on one another, and if one changes, the entire system is affected. Examples of this, the Cecropia trees have hollow stems and produce energy rich food at the base of their leaves. Azteca ants rely on the trees for this food and shelter. These ants fight off other insects trying to also feed from the same tree. Without these ants, Cecropia trees would be much more vulnerable to other predators. Adaptations of animals and plants in the rainforest. Plant adaptations. Lianas are woody vines that have roots in the ground but climb up trees to reach the sunlight. Their leaves and flowers grow in the canopy. Tree trunks. These are tall and thin to allow trees to reach the sunlight. The bark on these trees are smooth to allow water to flow down to the roots easily. Drip tips. These plants have leaves with pointy tips. This allows water to run off the leaves quickly without damaging or breaking them. Buttress roots are large roots which have ridges which create a large surface area that help to support large trees. Epiptites are plants which live on the branches of trees high up in the canopy. They get their nutrients from the air and water but not from the soil. Animal adaptations. The sloth uses camouflage and moves very slowly to make it difficult for predators to spot. The spider monkey has long strong limbs to help it to climb through the rainforest trees. The flying frog has fully webbed hands and feet and a flap of loose skin that stretches between its limbs, which allows it to glide from plant to plant. The toucan has a long, large bill to allow it to reach and cut fruit from branches that are too weak to support its weight. For more videos on GCSE English, French, Geography and Computer Science, subscribe to Know for GCSE. Thank you for watching and see you soon.